Well, welcome and good afternoon. It is such a pleasure to see everybody here today. At this time, please join us in our opening prayer. Let us pray. Our dearest and most gracious Heavenly Father, we thank you for the many blessings you continually bestow upon us. We thank you for allowing us to live in a nation and have the freedoms that we do. We ask for your blessing and guidance on this very meaningful project. Please give comfort and safety for those soldiers who are in harm's way. These things we ask in Jesus' name. Amen. At this time, please join as Mr. Kerry Bowe will lead us in our Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance Thank you, Mr. Boat. On behalf of the Veterans Hall of Heroes Board of Directors, welcome. We welcome our state delegation. We welcome all of our county representatives. Thank you so much. We welcome our city representatives. Thank you for coming. We also welcome our veterans and the price that they have paid. and also our visitors. Thank all of you for coming today. We appreciate your support for this very, very significant project. And my friends, I want you to know that there's no way that we can adequately express to you the significance of this very momentous occasion. For today is the first step in the implementation of a journey, a journey that began four years ago, a journey with a vision of creating a first-class exterior veterans memorial plaza, building a lasting memorial plaza to honor our veterans past, present, and future of all branches of the service. A journey that would give an opportunity to reflect military history. And this was a journey that presented many challenges. But these challenges were met with vigor and enthusiasm. At this time, I want to thank the Veterans Hall of Heroes Board of Directors, the Greenwood County Veterans Affairs Officer and his staff, for the countless hours that these individuals have contributed. Thank you. Their conscientious dedication, professionalism, and endurance on such a worthy exterior plaza during this journey. We also want to thank all of our veterans organizations and their auxiliaries for what they have given to this building and this plaza. We thank you so much. One thing that this journey has allowed us to do, and that, I, that is that our board has had the opportunity to develop a special bond between us and between our county and city and a very, very special bond between our very competent county and city managers, Mr. Toby Chapel and Mr. Charlie Barano, and their staff. And I would be remiss if I did not thank Mr. Tom Bishop for all he has given from the Greenwood County IT Department. Thank you. I also want to thank Davis and Floyd 
for the dedication and hard work they have given. And last but not least, we want to thank Mr. Tom Oglesby of the Keystone Memorial Incorporated out of Elberton, Georgia, for his guidance, his leadership, and most importantly, his patience on this journey. But friends, we look forward even more so to our next gathering, and that would be the completion of phase one and the dedication, ceremony, and unveiling of that very beautiful eagle. At this time, friends, this concludes our groundbreaking ceremony. You are invited to come inside where it is cooler to review our excellent museum that the museum committee has worked so diligently on. In the meantime, we will have a photo session for our board and our uh, representatives from uh, uh, the, the municipalities and uh, also the Greenwood CPW uh, has been a significant help in this project. Thank you so much for coming. May God bless America. Finally. 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 Four years. <laughs>